to my friends, teachers and respected principal sir. I am Sayeda Zohaira Ali of class 5B and today I prepared a speech on Eid Milad un Nabi. Eid Milad un Nabi is also known as Milad un Nabi. It is the festival to commemorate the birth anniversary of the Holy Prophet Muhammad. From the point of view Muslim, the date marks the most important event in the history of the world. On this occasion, therefore, public meetings are held in the mosque where religious teachers make speech of the different aspects of the life of this great man. The stories of the Prophet's birth, childhood, youth, adult life, character, teachings, suffering and, for and forgiveness of even his most bitter enemies. Prophet Muhammad was born about 14,000 years ago in Mecca and in Saudi Arabia. He is a prophet of Islam. He taught that there is one and only Lord who is Almighty Allah. And, pro and Prophet was his messenger. His followers are called Muslims. Muslims celebrate Eid Milad un Nabi because of Prophet Muhammad's birth. According to Muslim calendar, it was the 12th of the Rabi'ul Awwal. Hazrat Muhammad is the last and the final messenger of the earth, of the Allah. His life is full of lesson of the people of the world. His teachings are made not only for the benefits of Muslims, but for the whole human race. He is therefore rightly called Rahmatullah Alamin, which means boon and blessing for entire world. The birthday of the Holy Prophet Muhammad is celebrated from the east to the west and from the north to the south. We decorate our houses, the mosques, streets and buildings are illuminated. It is declared as a public holiday. Feasts are arranged and rice and meat dishes are served to the guests and also distributed among the poor. My family, friends and neighbors come to my house to celebrate. We all really enjoy in this festival. I love this festival very much. Thank you and have a nice day. My name is Sarah P. Santosh. I am studying in class 5C. We are remembering 118 death anniversary of Mark Gregorius Kuchu Tirmeni, known as Pamela Tirmeni. Saint Gregorius T. Vargas, popularly known as Pamela Tirmeni, was born on 15 June 1848 in distinguished priestly family in Kuchin, Kerala. From childhood days, he followed a very disciplined life which is enriched by prayers and fasting. His extraordinary ability to sing Syriac hymns beautifully at the age of 18, he was known as Shamsuno. The very next month of Shamsuno um, was ordained a Kasiso, which means full priest, and later Kor Episcopal. Later, he settled at Vertical Lyro near Molanthoti, where he led a very monast monastic life. In 1872, he was professed a Ramban monk priest. The Patrick ordinary Ramban gave Vargas a metropolitan by name Gregorius at the North Pavod St. Thomas Church. When, when he was 28, he came to know by the entering name Kuchu Tirmeni, the saintly father father was closely and intimately associated with varied activities and uh, development of Malankara um, Jacobite Syrian Church. He was very much admired for his organizing ability and was very popular with masses. 
Even in the midst of all busy schedule, he gave almost priority to prayer uh, and fasting. He used to get up at 4 a.m. for prayer and strictly followed the church practice of prayer um, seven times a day. Mark Gregorius was mean, mean in maintaining relationship with all section of people. Mm, he worked very hard for uplifting the poor people. At the age of uh, in at the age of f- fifty four, he became seriously sick. He knew that his end was near. While all priests and other were praying, Kuchutimini uttered my lord and closed his eyes on second November nineteen o two Monday. He passed away. Mm, he passed away and next day is till 4th November his body was kept on St. Peter Church, Pamela. A school has been found in the name of St. Peter, mm, great patron saint of India, Orthodox Church, Mark Gregorius of Pamela. I thank God for giving me the valuable time to speak about the famous personality. May God bless his soul. Um, th- thank you. रंगों में वो जादू है जो रंगने वाले भीगने वाले और देखने वाले तीनों के मन को विभोर कर देता है एक कलाकार रंगों और आकृतियों के माध्यम से जो कहना चाहता है वह किसी और माध्यम से नहीं कर सकता यही कारण है कि कलाकार अपने नाम से नहीं बल्कि काम से जाना जाता है नमस्कार मेरा नाम है प्रतिभा महाराणा और मैं एम सीनियर सेकेंडरी स्कूल में एक आर्ट टीचर हूँ आज के प्रोग्राम में आप सभी का बहुत बहुत स्वागत है हर व्यक्ति के अंदर एक कलाकार छुपा होता है जरूरत होती है तो सिर्फ उसे पहचानने की मैं सबसे पहले धन्यवाद करना चाहूंगी हमारे प्रिंसिपल सर का करस्पॉन्डेंट सर का शिफ्ट इंचार्ज मैम का और सभी टीचर्स का जिन्होंने न सिर्फ हमारे अंदर की छिपी हुई कला को पहचाना बल्कि उसे आगे लाने के लिए ई पोर्टल जैसा मंच भी प्रदान किया मैं विशेष रूप ऐसी आभार व्यक्त करती हूँ हमारे प्रिंसिपल सर का जिन्होंने हमें प्रेरणा अमूल्य सहयोग और उचित मार्गदर्शन प्रदान किया जिसकी सहायता से हम स्टूडेंट्स को इतनी अच्छी सेवा प्रदान कर पा रहे हैं आज का टॉपिक है ट्रांसपेरेंट लीफ पेंटिंग ट्रांसपेरेंट लीफ पेंटिंग बनाने के लिए हमें पत्तों को पहले ट्रांसपेरेंट करना होता है तो आइए देखते हैं कि हम पत्तों को किस तरह से ट्रांसपेरेंट कर सकते हैं ट्रांसपेरेंट लीफ बनाने के लिए हमें चाहिए कुछ ताजे पीपल के पत्ते एक कंटेनर और पानी पीपल के पत्ते को कंटेनर में रख के उसे पानी से भर देंगे इस तरह से इसे कम से कम 10 दिनों तक रखना है और डेली इसका पानी चेंज करना है 10 दिन के बाद आप देखेंगे लीफ कुछ इस तरह से दिखने लगता है अब इसे आप एक साफ ब्रश की सहायता से पूरा साफ कर लेंगे साफ करने के बाद इसे आप ड्राई कर लेंगे और आप देखेंगे कि लीव कुछ इस तरह से दिखने लगेगा अब यह लीव पेंटिंग के लिए रेडी है ट्रांसपेरेंट लीव पेंटिंग बनाने के लिए हमारे साथ है क्लास एट के स्टूडेंट तो आइए देखते हैं गुड इवनिंग रिस्पेक्टेड प्रिंसिपल सर शिफ्ट इन चार्ज मैम टीचर्स एंड ऑल माई डियर फ्रेंड्स माई सेल्फ जैना परवीन एंड आई एम फ्रॉम क्लास एट जे एम जे एम स्कूल सेक्टर सिक्स पी लाइव टूडे आई एम हियर प्रेजेंटिंग द स्केलेटन लीव पेंटिंग सो फर्स्ट लीव बिफोर स्टार्टिंग द पेंटिंग फर्स्ट वी हैव टू पेस्ट द ट्रांसपेरेंट लीव इन टू द राइट चार्ट पेपर विद द हेल्प ऑफ अ ग्लू गन एंड ऑल्सो यू कैन यूज फेविकॉल सो विदाउट एनी फर्दर डिले लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड
सो दिस इज माई पेंटिंग होप यू लाइक दिस पेंटिंग एंड ऑल्सो थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग दिस रिस्पेक्टेड टीचर्स एंड ऑल माई डियर फ्रेंड्स माई नेम इज बलजिंदर कॉट फ्रॉम क्लास एट and i'm studying in mgm senior secondary school sector 6 bilai so today i'm going to present leaf painting and my topic is peacock
So guys, our painting is completed and thanks for watching. Good afternoon everyone. This is Chaitanya Raghunji from Class Kate K. Today I am going to make a beautiful scenery on a transparent leaf of people. The material we require are two acrylic color and one poster color. The two acrylic color are orange and black and one poster color is chrome yellow medium hue. Before starting the paint, first we have to paste the leaf on a black chart or a black paper with a hot glue gun to make it beautiful. Let's start. So now our painting is completed. Thank you for watching this video. A very warm good evening to respected principal, sorry teacher, staff and each viewer. I am Divya Singh from Standard 8B Nehru House. I am going to make leaf painting. It took me several days to clear that leaf or make the leaf skeleton of people and took several minutes to paint it. I am going to use the acrylic paint of medium. So let's get started and be on the channel.
here's my painting and it was first attempt of mine I'm not passionate in this I want to thank the principal sir managing committees eight teachers and of course especially my art teacher Mrs. Pratibha Mahadana ma'am who given the opportunity to the children to be in an e-portal thank you and of course teaching for the new things and new attempting and good evening to all viewers and each onlookers good evening everyone i am ashmi tanan from class 8i today i am going to make a beautiful scenery with only three poster colors white orange and black on a transparent leaf before starting our painting we have to paste our transparent leaf on a black sheet with fabricol or with hot glue gun so now let's start our painting So now our painting is ready. As you can see, so thank you and have a nice day. Thanks for watching. आज का आखिरी पेंटिंग है क्लास एट के स्टूडेंट पी अजय का जो यह संदेश देना चाहते हैं कि कोरोना जैसे महामारी के बुरे दिन जाएंगे और एक नया सवेरा आएगा तो आइए देखते हैं पेंटिंग गुड इवनिंग रिस्पेक्टेड प्रिंसिपल सर टीचर्स एंड ऑल माई डियर फ्रेंड्स माई नेम इज पी अजय For class eight B, I am studying MGM Senior Secondary School, Sector Six, Bilai. 
Today I am present transparent leaf painting. My painting completed. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you, students. आप सभी ने बहुत ही सुंदर पेंटिंग बनाई अब अंत में सुविचार क्यों डरें कि जिंदगी में क्या होगा क्यों सोचे कि हर वक्त बुरा होगा बढ़ते रहे मंजिलों की ओर हम कुछ ना मिला तो क्या हुआ तजुर्बा तो नया होगा आशा करती हूँ आज का एपिसोड आप सभी को पसंद आया होगा मिलते हैं नेक्स्ट एपिसोड में एक नए आर्ट के साथ तब तक के लिए नमस्कार